Sports Connection, sponsored by Sterling Chiropractic. Another week of football is in the books. Welcome into this week's edition of Sports Connection. I am Caden Gaylord Day, and as always, it's my guy, Mr. Brian Webb. Sir, how you doing? Today? Man, I'm great. What a, it was kind of weird because you got fall break coming, yeah. so, so we had some Thursday night football. Uh, we had a lot of different stuff. Yeah, we're just going to jump right into it. The game of the week, one of the best games of the season, Warren East versus Allen County Scottsville with the Patriots pulling off the 17-point cup. 17-point comeback win to beat the Raiders. What did you see out there, Brian? Well, I'll tell you what. This was the game of the week for sure. And, and you know, to, to, I wish we had like 20 minutes to talk about this <laughs> right. game because there's it's that so kind of much, a yeah. – it, there's like a plot to it and there's a setting, <laughs> you know, like English 300. But, uh, but no, it's, it's unbelievable what, you know, they were able to do in this game to come back. And, you know, it could be one of the biggest wins for Coach Hood okay. and the Patriots. When, you know, he's been there, what, 18, 19 years. I mean, it, it's – it's definitely up there is one of the most memorable. Uh, but, you know, there were some big chunk plays in this. They, they kept them in it and uh, kept them fighting, but they went in at half. Uh, I can't remember what the score was at halftime. I think 16 to 7 or something like that. Uh, and then, you know, basically, Coffee caught a big old pass from Braylon Adams. Uh, and, you know, he was just hitting different receivers, man. And then you had Chase Ross with 84 yards. You had Braden Holland with 86. And, and Braylon Adams had 229 yards. But Dane had 223 yeah. yards passing. Uh, the, the Raiders, I mean, they looked so rushing. They looked, they, it was just. It's just defense. You got to get the defense. It was just the together. game itself, man. And yeah. it was homecoming there. You, you know, you that mix that lot. in. Uh, crazy, but Jackson McCool had a big night, man. It was just uh, Lightfoot had a big night. Yeah, it was a great, great win for the Patriots there. Up next, Franklin Simpson. They beat Glasgow 35 to 21. Man, I tell you, uh, this, I, I didn't get to hear a lot about this game, but I will say this: the Franklin Simpson Wildcats and Mad Max's Warriors. <laughs> The Road Warriors, uh, they did pretty good in this one. But, you know, Lane Offords come up big last couple of weeks. Colin Anderson had a huge game, had two TDs in this one. Brady Delk, he does a, such a good job back there uh, as QB. Uh, they're back on track, the yeah. Wildcats. Next up, the Russellville Panthers. They beat Ballard Memorial 48-24. to Shout out to the Panthers, man. They they got more wins this year than they have the past previous two years. So they are they are rolling right now. Remember me saying, win. Mikey Benton is going to get a lot more he's, Ws. He's going to get him right back on track. Track. And then up next, Caverna. They got a big win, 60 to 12 against Fulton County. Woo! Man, that the thing. Twins. We the had Martins. the Martins. Yeah, the Martins, man. We the had them Martin all a couple sighting. weeks ago. They are big dudes, and they are running they are. over everybody. A huge win out there yeah, for go? the Caverna Cardinals. Cardinals. And then look at our other scores around the week. We had a bunch of other games that were outside of Warren County in Woo. South Central Kentucky. Barron Trojans. County had their first, first loss, loss of the season, 14-6 to six there. Uh, Greenwood shut out Ohio County, 42-0. to zero. Storm Hart and County. Norman Caden Schwarzkopf <laughs> has something. Yeah, and uh, Levi Wyatt had four touchdowns. Oh, yeah. Today. Hard County 40 to 21 over that was a big County. one huge game there huge. Monroe County showing out this year 29 0 win over Metcalf County of course Bowling Green 49 14 over Christian County and Warren Central that score is the wrong way Warren Central lost uh -oh. 26 to 6 against Central that's Harden. the only loss I had on my pick Friday night was Warren Central I had them but that the heart and dare let's go back there real quick Brennan Griffin had 202 yards on the ground, man. 14 total tackles in this one. And uh, Cam Asbury is a beast, 9 for 95. So, uh, Absolutely. A lot of, that was a lot a good of game, football man. going into a fall break here. But speaking yeah. of fall, we got the BGKY Boxing Crew up in here as they talk about the BGKY Fall Championship. So don't go anywhere right here on Sports Connection. 